Hi everyone, I'm here in Berlin, Germany uh, with Sophia Baumut from GIZ. Uh, Climate and GIZ have just started a new partnership. And Sophia, you are really working to get science into policy and action. How do you do that? Thank you, Danish, for this question and thank you for inviting me to this um, short shot. Um, so I'm working with GIZ, as you said, and I'm working in the sector project agriculture. And the main mandate of the sector project agriculture is to really support um, the Federal Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development, BMZ, um, in their endeavors. And um, bridging science and policy is one of our main ta tasks. And how do we do that? We have a lot of intelligence within GIZ. We have projects on the ground. So we can use um, lots of evidence that we can feed into our support. But still we need also external um, input from um, scientific institutions to really be up to date and to know what is going on. So, Sophia, as you know, we want to be a think and do tank for food and climate, and we want to focus on the action. So how can we support you uh, as GIZ to help do that, to help do the doing better? Yeah, I think it's, um, it's interesting. It's bridging the science and policy gap. And there, um, I think the collaboration with Climate and GIZ is very good. And then coming in from the think and do tank angle, it's, it's um, even more interesting because it's really about bringing the theory into um, implementation. And that's also what our ministry is striving for. And I think there are many um, opportunities for our partnership to really make this happen and to think about how we can bring our good ideas to the ground and really um, contribute to our overall vision to improve the livelihood of smallholder farmers worldwide. I'm glad you used the word implementation because uh, this year there's COP27 in Egypt and the theme is together for implementation. So we want to bring stakeholders together for that ambition. So how, what is your view and your vision for COP27? What can we do together? Yeah, interestingly, we called our partnership agreement um, Road to COP27 and Beyond. So I think this is a really good starting point to start cooperation and um, think along this road to COP27 and beyond what um, we could do strategically to advance our agenda. So right now we are just coming from a workshop and kicked off um, a, a, a working stream under the German presidency about compensation, about um, better financing of smallholder farmers and we did it already in partnership. I think that's a great example and I think there are many other ideas what we could do together. Great Sophia, looking forward to collaborating with you on the road to COP27 and beyond.